Awesome. Cola Vita. Cola Vita. Ah, women cycling. Bianchi is the best. It is. The pizza truck was built in 2015 and we use it for many different kinds of events. We use it for sampling events, charity events, and endurance events. And it's quite an operation. It has a wood-fired oven imported from Italy and it takes about an hour and a half to heat up so it gets to about a thousand degrees or so to cook pizza. So they cook really quickly in about 60 to 90 seconds. Uh, we have refrigeration and sinks and plumbing inside, so it's all run by a generator. And today what we're doing is we are feeding the first responders and town officials of Edison as a thank you for their dedication and service during COVID-19. So Cola Vida USA is located here in Edison, New Jersey, and we really wanted to take the time to thank the town for all their service. and feed them some amazing pizza because it is really, really tasty. Today, I think we're feeding about 125 people, including our employees and the town officials. It's really important to make sure that we have everything right. So we were inspected by the health department, which is great. Um, we're also feeding our own staff, all of our warehouse and corporate, um, corporate members. So, you know, everybody get some pizza. And everybody, it's great to be here at the Cola Vida. Uh, do a great job. So as you know, the times are very challenging, and um, they don't get enough thanks. I mean, any, anytime something goes wrong, they're the first ones to get blamed. Um, and obviously, it means so much to them. And they they hear, they hear those thanks, and they know that people are recognizing what they're doing. That's not why they do what they do. They do it because it's needed. But it's always great to hear that thank you and to, to honor them because it's been very, very difficult times. Uh, and we feel like this is a really nice thing to do since we haven't been able to do a lot of things with the pizza truck because of COVID-19, to really be able to check all the boxes of health and safety and help our employees feel good and help the town feel good too. Um, we're hoping that next year we'll have a full schedule of events as usual. You know, we take the truck as far as California during the year to do events there, and it goes down to Florida in um, it goes down to Florida in January for a big marathon and event with public supermarkets. So we're all keeping our fingers crossed that everything goes well and um, and we can start to plan as usual again. Colavina is uh, just what Edison's all about. It's small businesses located, trying to do everything right for the community. Um, their products are great, everybody utilizes them. I know I go into the supermarket, and I'm buying the olive oil, I'm buying the pasta. Um, so it just is, is what Edison is all about. It was built on businesses like Colavita, and it's great to have Colavita in Edison. It's pretty hard to run this pizza truck. It's a lot of work, it's a lot of physical labor, and it's a lot of food prep. So we have a really great team that runs the truck, um, Mary Zeider and Andy Smith, and they are really, they take such good care of the truck, first of all, and they drive it around, and they do all the prep and the serving. You know, I'm here to help coordinate and serve when I can. I'm, I'm pretty good with a pizza peel. All right. Pizza, you're welcome. We use our own Colavita crushed tomatoes, fresh, not, no, nothing cooked, no marinara sauce, just fresh crushed tomatoes in our Tetra packs. And then of course we use our Colavita extra virgin olive oil. We have a few different kinds of oil. We have our premium selection and our premium Italian, which is a little bit more bold. And, um, and then of course mozzarella cheese. Now we have a few different pizza variations. We have a spicy one that we're gonna do today. This is our traditional margarita, and we'll put fresh basil on top of that when it's done. But then we have a spicy one that people really like with jalapenos and hot honey. It's not very traditional, you know, in the truest sense of Neapolitan pizza, but it is something fun and people like to try the spicy pizza. It's pretty simple and it's really, really delicious. You want a piece? <laughs> 
Welcome to Colavita. My name is Giovanni Colavita. I'm the CEO of the Colavita USA and the third generation of the family in the business. My family, the Profaci family, and our Colavita team are so very honored to host our town officials today to thank you for all you do for the community and share with you the fresh pizza of our pizza truck. During this very sensitive time, we all needed to take extra precautions to stay safe and healthy. Many of you providing essential services can social distance. You need to come within the six feet of others to do your jobs and keep the community safe. We want to express our gratitude to all of you. All of you deserve our appreciation and admiration. All our police officers, emergency medical technicians, firefighters and others who continue to respond to calls and medical emergency tireless every day. We rely on your efforts to keep us safe and Colavita is proud to be part of this strong community of Edison. I would also like to personally thank all the Colavita employees for their hard work during this challenging time. Without you and your positive attitude, we couldn't have responded to the high demand of essential products during the peak of the crisis. So as you know, businesses have been really impacted tremendously, especially the restaurant industry. Um, you know, they were closed down. We tried to, you know, allow them to operate in their parking lots and in tents and, 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 and everything, which they have been able to do. But as the weather's starting to turn, obviously outdoor dining is not as uh, enjoyable as it was during the summer months. And obviously uh, employment has been affected. So for businesses like Colavita to be able to operate and two, to maintain their employment numbers is just instrumental in just keeping everybody's morale up, keeping obviously the economy going, and keep, keeping people's families fed and uh, you know, clothed and, and, and whatnot. So um, it's ultra important and I uh, applaud Colavita for doing everything that they've done um, every day, but especially during the pandemic. We also have gift bags for all the town officials coming today. In addition, we're gonna send their offices um, bigger gift boxes for all their employees to try. But in this one, we have, of course, this is our premium Italian extra virgin olive oil. This is all Italian olives, very important. Um, it's a delicious product with a little peppery taste to it. We have our balsamic vinegar of Modena, also delicious. I use this stuff for everything. We also have our Colavita spaghetti. And we have, you know, Colavita distributes other brands as well. So we distribute Paragina. Um, so we have a selection of different Paragina chocolate bars. We have Oh, I like this one. The milk chocolate with caramelized almonds is delicious. And also bocce. This is a candy that is like very well known in Italy. It's a delicious hazelnut truffle coated in dark chocolate. I love these things. Um, so we distribute that as well. And in addition, we have some Molino Bianco cookies and Rio Mare tuna. So this is a pretty good gift pack. You know, I think I think people will be pretty happy with these. We have a good selection of everything we have. So that is going to all the town officials today. Yeah. <laughs>